Welcome to Raven's Over. Please go to my channel or send the notification bell, like this video, and share. Welcome to another edition of What Would You Do? What would you do if you wasn't afraid? Just about a trans attracted man that lies to the trans woman. He feels as though he's tried to talk to so many trans women. A lot of times men want to feel experience of being with a trans woman so he don't exactly tell her the truth. Share this video and let me explain. Oh, baby. Welcome to What Would You Do? What would you do if you weren't afraid? I make these videos and start a conversation where I feel as though a lot of times when two couples meet or two people meet, that's a different understanding. And a lot of times people are very afraid to talk or share their truth. And I start the conversation as I'm sharing with you. Share this video if we can, like this video. Now the story begins. A trans attracted man wants to be with a trans woman. So he's not exactly telling her the truth. He tells her, I've been with trans women before. I've taken them on dates. I've been out everywhere. I have no problem with living my truth. I go anywhere with her. I don't care. I'm a real man. But at the end of the day, he's not exactly telling her the truth. He's lying to her. But he's not going to express the fact of the matter that he's not telling her the truth. He's going to ride it out. Now here it is. She's thinking, hey, he's been with a bunch of girls like me before, so this is not unground territory. Every girl is different. Now, the girls he'd been with was basically, you know, somewhat dominant, somewhat um, submissive. So it depends, whatever the case may be. But in this case, he's been with a woman that was very much generally, generally she's very submissive. But guess what? Due to the fact that his lie is going on, he doesn't quite know what he's doing. So he's riding out, trying to see whatever happens. He's just playing along with it. You know, he's going along just to get along. But at the end of the day, the truth will come out. So he's doing things with her. He's treating her exactly the way she needs to be treated, like a woman. Kissing her, doing everything for her. And the thing about it, it comes down for sex. So then... He begins to have sex with her. And then the conversation comes up. Do you go down on females? He says, yeah, I go. I have oral sex on females. Then she says, well, why can't you have oral sex with me? He says, well, I thought you wanted to be respected as a woman. So why do I have to do oral sex on you? And she says, well, I am a woman. But I don't understand why my body anatomy doesn't make me complete of what a woman is. Cause now you start me feel like I am a cisgender male and not a woman. Now he's looking at her saying, well, I've never done that before. That's never been my thing. Now this is where it gets tricky. He's been other girls that was just, didn't want nobody to see it, didn't want them to touch it, didn't want anything. But now there's a girl that's different. She wants you to touch it. In fact, she wants you to orally sex to satisfy her. But you herself is saying, I don't want to do that. That's not my thing. I've never done that. So now, in his mind, he's looking at it as a penis. In your mind, you're looking at it as a clit. So this is where it becomes difficult. Because now at this, at this point, <laughs> at this point, <laughs> he's thinking... <laughs> She want me to suck her <laughs> She want me She want me to suck her off. <laughs> she want me to suck her off. Now I'm feeling a certain kind of way because now I'm feeling a little gay. In her mind, she's like, 
I'm a little offended because I feel like I am a woman. I am a woman. So why is it that you make me feel like I'm a man? Now at this point, she feels as though he may have not been with a lot of girls like me. So now she's starting to question his, what kind of girls you been with before? He explained. She said, you didn't do oral? He says, no, that's never been their thing. They didn't want me to touch it. He said, well, every girl is different. I'm different. So at this point, what do you think he would do? Would it bother you that he wouldn't see you as the same cisgender woman because simple fact of the matter is that your anatomy is similar to his? And as a trans attractive man, please sign in. Do you feel offended that she's asking you to treat her like you would treat a woman? If you could give oral to her, why is it that you can't give oral to me? Why you feel as though my body is so disgusting when her body, the sister in the woman body, is so beautiful? But you're in this side of the field and you're messing with girls like myself. So why is it that you're making me feel like I am a sister in the man instead of the woman that you stopped on the street to be with? So, trans attracted men, what would you do if you wasn't afraid? Would you tell her the truth? Listen, I've never been with no one like you. This is new. I lied. Or would you just go ahead and wing it and do it? Or would you just find a way to break it off of her? And as a two spirit woman, would you feel offended? when you know why he's not doing it. Because in his mind, he's looking at you as a biological male. He's no longer looking at you as a female and he's thinking, this is gay. Now remember, this is just sex. There are females out here, sister, that's pegging men. So why is it that when it comes down to this two-spirit woman, she now has become a biological male when approach on the same sexual favor that a female would do. So, to my trans attracted men, what would you do if you wasn't afraid? Would you come clean? Would you tell the truth? Would you break it off? A two-spirit woman, would you be offended if he said, that's not my thing, and he wants to leave and break it off with you? Even though you got along, even though everything was perfect, would you leave? What would you do if you wasn't afraid comment below share this video if we can it is time to have the conversation share this video if we can and i'm gonna let you i love you and thank you for watching kids three